Good morning. Two of my favorite places, City Hall and Seton Hall. I'm a proud Pattersonian and I'm a proud pirate today. And we are going to be honoring a gentleman who's a proud Pattersonian and a proud pirate. As a matter of fact, he's making history. He's the first Pattersonian to get inducted into the Seton Hall Basketball Hall of Fame. He starred at Patterson Catholic and for three straight years, the team led by this gentleman won three straight titles. But also like in 2012, he was drafted by my favorite basketball team in the NBA, the New Jersey Nets. Mm -hmm. Still follow them even though they're in Brooklyn, it's fine. <laughs> we go to games sometimes. But today, it is an honor to honor a fellow proud Pattersonian and proud pirate in Fuquan Edwin. Tomorrow he will be officially inducted into the Seton Hall University Basketball Hall of Fame. But today, if Patterson had a Hall of Fame, he'd be in it as well. So I want to thank the gentleman to my right who brought to my attention that this historic moment was about to manifest. He is a legendary coach in his own right at Patterson Catholic. He's a proud Pattersonian, unfortunately not a proud pirate. Trojan. Trojan. <laughs> we won't hold that against you. <laughs> but ladies and gentlemen, our assemblyman from the 35th Legislative District, Coach Benji Wimberly. You got a coach, uh, Good morning still, but it's really a great honor. Um, Fuquan, I've known since he's been a little guy. And, uh, he was like, a little guy? Yeah, he was a little guy one okay. time. Like, <laughs> I got my humble beginnings with Alabama projects and coming up through recreation, playing basketball, um, two weeks of football. But at Patterson Catholic, uh, his squads took uh, BC to a new level. Everybody knows about Tim Thomas and all the other guys, but the last couple of years, you guys, the last year, I think you ranked number six nationally and won some major tournaments. And I um, couldn't be proud of you. So when one of my friends from St. Hall goes to me, Do you know who wants being inducted into the Hall of Fame? I said, what, are you crazy? We're going to be there. I did reach out to the mayor, let the mayor know because I knew he was a seat all alone. And um, tomorrow night, yes. we have 100 people from Patterson yes. wearing people on Edwin shirts. And their dreams will come to fruition like yours have come. They have a beautiful family, a beautiful wife, and kids. Yes. And mayor, yes, thank you. Thank, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I will. I will. I'll wear this. It's a large. <laughs> I did have a big breakfast, but I'll do my best to yeah, suck my stomach. But so the Thank kids you. from Patterson Recreation, some of the high school players are also going to be there tomorrow. Some of your coaches will be there. Uh, Coach Wright, Coach Salmon. Yes. Uh, all those guys are going to come out. So come over and say hello to the kids and let them know that you know dreams can't come true from the city of Patterson. Yes. So we're proud of you. Congratulations. Thank you. Oh, Thank you. And we do have a yes. citation from him from Senator Nelly Poe, some of them in Siobhan Asuncu that we will read into record that is signed by Senate President Oscar Terry and Speaker Greg Coughlin, and it's in the office, but we will also be Yes. There. All right, thank you. How come he didn't finish with football? Uh, because uh, he had a better career in basketball. Yeah, good answer. Good answer. That's a good answer. We got two Jay. We got two Jay. That was good, that was good. Yeah, I was going to say that the best decision that Faquan Edwin ever made was to go to Seton Hall. But I stand to be corrected because I'm sure the best decision ever made was to marry Courtney and have two children with one on the way. <laughs> and there's some speculation that you're going for a starting five. Is that true? <laughs> Whoa! No, oh, that's news. That was breaking news right there on Eyewitness News. <laughs> Nevertheless, there's no more that needs to be said. Today, the city of Patterson is proud to honor one of our own, a proud Pattersonian and a proud pirate, who tomorrow will be a Hall of Famer, Mr. Faquan Edwin. <laughs> yes. I don't want to take off my shirt. All right, Fuquan, the floor is yours, please. We budgeted for 45 minutes, so if you want to talk about oh, that, please. Don't be listening. Please, Fuquan. Be sure to sleep. 
Come on, you're not short. Yeah. Thank Good you. Good morning, everyone. Uh, I just want to say um, it's a blessing to be here. Yes. You know, um, it's, it's, I'm humble, you know, and appreciate it just, just to be acknowledged, you know, by the city where I grew up and was raised and had humble beginnings, you know, growing up um, in the Alabama projects where it was tough. Um, I seen light in basketball, you know. We had a, a basketball court there where I stayed on it every day. You know, I used to get in trouble where my mom, I'd be out there late night and I had a curfew and my mom, I would get in trouble for just staying out there. But, um, you know, just for the kids in Patterson growing up that have dreams with any sports, just work hard, you know, and be dedicated to your craft. You know, you're gonna have people, you know, I come from where I had the talent, but it wasn't really, it wasn't really noticeable, you know, so. Just having the opportunity to go to Seton Hall and be local, it was a blessing, and I was appreciative for that, you know, so I just want to appreciate the mayor, yeah. appreciate Benji again for acknowledging me, and that's about it. Thank you. Thank you. One last note. So, oh, let's have the coach come up. Jim, Jimmy Savage, please come up. <laughs> Perfect time. Your oh. timing is almost impeccable, <laughs> ladies and gentlemen. A legendary coach in his own right, basketball coach in Patterson, Coach Jimmy Salmon. Please, come on. Yeah, please. Come on. Yeah, come on. We got you. Hey, man. How are you? Good to see you, too. Thank you. Hello. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> Good afternoon, everyone. Good afternoon. Uh, I'm honored to be here. Uh, anyone celebrating Fuquan, uh, if I know about it, I'm definitely you know, going to be there. He played in the program that I ran for over 10 years, and he is what Patterson to me uh, is about. No one gave him a, a uh, or no one would have thought that he'd be in the position that he's in right now and would even be going into the Hall of Fame at Seton Hall. So I'm gonna say this on behalf of Damon Wright, myself, Tommy Patterson, all the other guys who had an opportunity to be a part of his journey. We're super proud of him. And again, representing them, I'm happy to be here. Yes. So all has been said, we really appreciate our fellow proud Pattersonian, proud pirate as well. Yes? Yeah, 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 yeah. And I want to say one thing, beyond basketball, you can see, look, he's a family man. He's a role model for our children, someone you can emulate. He talked about his days back in the Alabama projects, and look at where he's coming. Yes. And where he is and where he's going as a father, a father figure to others. So bear witness. For Quan Edwin is a proud son of Patterson and a father figure now to many people. Thank you very much.